What is up guys? Here we go again. Another Freaktography Abandoned Mansion Adventure. Guys, this one is going to blow your minds. Every single room in this house is different. 1960s, 1970s, 1980s. Guys, every single room in this house has got a different design and a different style. I'm here with my good friend DJ So Sincere. His link is down below. Make sure you guys follow him on Instagram. Guys, quit talking. Let's get right to it. Cue the music. Cue the intro. See you guys on the other side. Okay, here we go guys. We are starting right where we started in that funky weird looking chair. No clue what that style or design is called, but we're going to look it up and we're going to figure it out. If it's a certain artist, if it's a certain name, if it's from a certain uh, time period, 60s, 70s, I don't know, but we're going to look it up. This whole room is designed and, uh, and built in that style, red and blue with these funky little uh, designs and shapes all over the walls. Super cool. And look at this little fridge. It's like an old style fridge. Look at that thing. That is cool. Wow. Morphe Richards fridge. That's really neat. So we're going to back up and then we're going to just pan around a little bit here. And again, like I said in the intro, you guys, every room has a different style, a different look, a different design, different color scheme. It's so cool. Can't wait to show you guys. Here we got a brick wall that doesn't really seem to match, but there's a marionette toy. All right, so moving on, we'll do a quick one last pan of this room. I'll show you guys from left to right. You got a 10 pound dumbbell on the floor. Not quite enough for the Urbex guns today. Uh, old Urbex Dave needs a little bit more weight than that to work the Urbex guns. So 10 pounds just ain't gonna cut it. Anyways, so we go through this door into this room here. And we've got this interesting looking, uh, I don't know if it's a calendar or something. It only goes to 24. So not really sure what's going on here. But then you've got your staircase and you've got the disgusting uh, carpet. It's very dirty, very dirty. But this staircase goes all the way up to the top floor. We'll see that one later. Now we're going to move on to the different inspiration here. And this is a room with, it's like a material on the, on the, on the walls here, as you can see. It's like a material. It's very gross. It's very brown. It's very dusty, but the contrast is interesting because you go into this bathroom here and you've got these colorful, uh, I'm guessing tulips or something in the bathroom, followed by a what is up guys in the mirror there. And then you go into the next room, which is like a shower and a change room for the swimming pool. And it's got these brown flowers, like these 1960s style brown and, and orange and yellow flowers we do have another mirror so i do have to give you guys another what is up guys and then you've got here you've got a shower and then there's a sauna back there and then here you can go outside and there's two swimming pools guys over there there's two swimming pools in the backyard okay so moving on Behind each of these is a change room. 
as you can see, so you can get changed and have a shower and go for a swim and go in the sauna, all right? And then we're going to head on into this room, which is equally as brown. And uh, maybe this was an office or something at some point. You've got a bookshelf here. As you can see, there is power. It's in really rough shape, this house, but there is power, which is my uh, second very abandoned house that we've been in today that has power. Very dangerous, guys. Very dangerous. There's a small sink in here and a stove, so there's a little kitchen in this part of the house. And then we carry on into this next room, which there's a really cool spiral staircase. It's very brown down here, guys. So we open this door here, and there's this really interesting looking room. You got this window here that puts this interesting, strange sort of hue into the room. There's your normal window, but when you put this over it, it sets the tone and the, mo and the mood for the room with this brown. And we've got some art on the walls here. See? Art. And then there's a little fridge in there. Okay, what's up here, guys? Nothing. So we continue on into the brown room where there's like a brown leather uh, material on the walls. And then you've got this really unique shaped set of stairs here that curve down. And come on in. And we've got some African themed decorations on the walls. And then there's uh, some shelving here with, uh, there, well, there's some different awards and bottles. Some more bottles up top there. Got a little mini cannon right there. And then over here, is the uh, intercom system for the house. These are all over the house. These really old intercom. Got a fireplace here, okay? Fireplace. And so we've now just covered the whole basement of this house. From the sort of uh, mid-century modern room at the other end, all the way over here to this sort of African-inspired room, to whatever's going on in the middle there. So now we've got the spiral staircase, and uh, we'll head on up the spiral staircase. But it's hard to do this with a camera, so we'll take a quick break, and I'll see you guys in a minute. All right, so we just came up this spiral staircase here. It's got this old-looking green railing. This is where the old people would live, because as you can see, there's, uh, there's these railings on the, on the walls to help the old people get by. <sighs> Excuse me. So this would be your master bedroom. Not much left over, not much to see. What's this? Somebody's uh, funeral, or somebody's burial plot, picture of it. One photo hanging on the wall. There it is. There's your curtains, beautiful curtains. And then a great big closet. So let's keep on going show you guys the different rooms we have here. There's a bathroom here with some very shiny silver paisley wallpaper. Check it out guys. Silver paisley on white, on white tile. Silver paisley on white tile guys.
and then we're going to move on into this room. This here is actually a, uh, a trap door that goes up, I believe, up into the, uh, um, the attic, but you can't get to it because this is holding it closed. So not a whole lot to see here, but this bathroom is where it's at. First of all, there's this really interesting cotton candy painted wall here. And then there's a bunch of mirrors. There. How's it going, guys? What's up, guys? And uh, there's a warning here from Timo uh, to not turn on the bathroom heater. And then there's one of these, one of these uh, handicapped person bathtub shower things. You can sit in it. It's comfortable. You can open the door. And then we go to the next room, which has peace doves on the walls. As I said, every room is different. Every room has a different design, has different wallpaper. This weird little desk here. There's a picture of an old family there. And then head on into this room. This guy's got wallpaper for all the different astrological signs. I got an idea. How about everybody comment in the video comment down below, what is your astrological sign? That's a good thing to comment. There's me right there. I'm a Pisces. There it is. So drop a comment down below and tell me what is your astrological sign. Got a Led Zeppelin record here on the wall. And what do we got? Just a bunch of just garbage here. Cards. But what's interesting is all the rooms connect to each other. So now we can go from this room into this bathroom here. And then we go into the next, uh, we go into the next bedroom. But look at this thing I just found. This little thing here with this little soap dispenser. Look, you can hide it. See? It goes like that. And there it is. Pretty neat, eh? It's in here. Nothing. And there's another one on this side. All right. Okay, let's continue into the next bedroom. I have no idea what's going on with this wallpaper. It's some kind of a sketch wallpaper. It looks like a guy on a horse. And then a kid holding like a pair of scissors or something. I don't know what it looks like anyways. Here's some stuff that people have laid out that they've found in here. Somebody's identification and some photos. Okay. Oh, there's another room over here. Here's your intercom again. And this room's just very plain and boring, so we're not going to bother. And it's a very long house, guys. So here's your main floor staircase right there. Give you a nice panning shot of this room. There you go. Nice staircase. Disgusting uh, carpet. Chandelier. And then, continuing on with the theme of different wallpapers, this room's got a bunch of tulips on the walls. This bathroom here, very bright and blue, orange. And it's a really old sink right there. Look at that old brass uh, sink fixtures there. This wallpaper is very shiny and sparkly. If you look at it under a certain light, it actually sparkles. So now we're going to move into the yellow room, which is the kitchen. And you can take a look outside. It was snowing pretty heavily earlier, but not anymore. So here's your kitchen. Very yellow. There's a very small stove here. 
And then there's this really old Frigidaire stove. Very, very old. Look how that opens. Wow. Right there. That's neat. I never knew that they opened like that. That's pretty neat. Oh, look at this. And then this opens out. Look at that. Wow. I had no idea, guys. And then we push it back in. Whoa. I had no idea that that did that. Neat. All right, and then they got another, looks like a gas top here with a, with, a, with a range hood. So there's a look at your kitchen, pretty good kitchen. And then this room here, we've got this type of wallpaper. It's like a material, it's not paper. And there's your big old gigantic green floor to ceiling curtains. Light fixture there. And now we're on the other end of the house. So we made it into this room. Don't know what this room would have been. But this has got some interesting wall uh, treatment as well. This is not paper. It's, it's a material. The carpet is disgusting. It's completely filthy. And then there's two swimming pools out there. Big living room. You can tell that they've removed the carpet. Okay, we're gonna head upstairs and then we're done. I think I hear, I think I hear DJ so sincere. I think I hear him. There he is. <laughs> he stays off camera, guys. He's not interested in being on camera. He runs away when I come by. <laughs> Pretty nice chandelier. Yeah, I saw that. It goes down into that bedroom that's got all the, uh, the, yeah. This room here, I don't know what's going on with this wallpaper. It's got some kind of a foil, shiny, brown and silver wallpaper. Nasty mattress leaning up against the wall. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. Even the ceiling is shiny. See what I mean? This room sucks. It's just blue, eh? Yeah. 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 Then there's like an attic furnace room. This is that trap door that I showed you guys. That's blocked off from the floor below us. Wait, I've been exploring with uh, free time. <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> <laughs> here I didn't see this oh wow and then there's a little book crafts and hobbies the golden book of crafts and hobbies and it's got uh, Native American uh, imagery on it probably considered offensive by today's standards right remember these books the Kaye exercise book remember those <laughs> February 5th, 1981. Yesterday, I had a hockey game against Grand River and lost 6-0, because you suck. <laughs> yeah. Yesterday, in swimming, I was asked to move up to the black or red groups. Good for you. On Sunday, I went to my hockey practice. And then, and then Mike L came over for three hours and then our coach pick you up for the hockey game where we lost three, <laughs> three nothing against York Mills because you suck. <laughs> Kids got pretty good penmanship though. That's pretty cool. Interesting find. What else we got back here? This is where we're gonna get 
attacked by a raccoon or something. It's just a bunch of insulation back here, spare wallpaper and what have you. Okay guys, I'll be right back. Okay guys, that's a wrap on this one. This has been a really interesting house with all the different wallpaper and different styles, different elements, different inspirations from different countries and different, uh, different decades. Hope you guys have liked it. Thanks to uh, DJ So Sincere for joining us. Again, his links are down below. Make sure you follow him on Instagram. And that's it, guys. So what are you going to do? Like, comment, share, subscribe. See what I'm wearing? I'm wearing a photography hoodie. Guys, there's a link below if you want to get yourself a photography hoodie. So that's going to do it, guys. we got other places to go. Got to get home. Got to go to work tomorrow. So you guys know what to do. Like, comment, share, subscribe. See you next time. Peace.